on the mirror's edge, your boys team with Twitch Garage. Okay, let's try go through video. Today, guys, we finna go ahead and do the HD flinning on the on the step side today. We finna go pick up the parts right now as we speak. It's about what, like eight, nine, about to be nine. But yeah, guys, we're gonna do the AC front end. We're gonna do grill, bumper pad, and then we're gonna go with the Tahoe Season One Valance today. We're not. We're gonna leave the stock the stock hood for right now. Porque la mera neta, I'm gonna get a custom one, one with the HD cat hood with the Z01 scoop. That's the one I'm really gonna get. And then I'm gonna change these out whenever I get a chance. I'm gonna change these out and I'm gonna put the U bar because right now I have the L bar, but I want the U bar when that comes up to here. But yeah, guys, today's gonna be an adventure. We're gonna go out with Grand Perry today, and. Hopefully, guys, when we go, we'll be able to do all this today. Because, to be honest, it's going to be a bitch. It's going to be a long-ass time for us to do it. Especially since it's like I have to cut the bumper brackets and I have to re-weld them on. But, yeah, guys, I'm going to show you how to do it. It should be a little quick. A little quick. One, two, three. No, no. No pasa nada. But, yeah, guys, hopefully we get there safe. Ahorita vamos y recogemos todas las partes so we can put it on today. Because I really want to put it on today because I got school on Tuesday. And, you know, I want to show off the truck. So, yeah. Hopefully we'll be able to put everything on today. Primeramente Dios. But yeah, guys, we'll see y'all there soon, man. Y'all already know. Toys Garage on top. We coming up big this year. 2024 is our year, my boy. Y'all already know how we rocking now. <laughs> Y ahí llegamos aquí al shop que van de partes a bring on get the HD funnel for the bubble wire. But yeah, look at this place, guys. Aquí traen de todo, man. I'll put the link, I'll put the address down here. It's in Texas, in Grand Perry. Aquí traen muchas partes para ustedes, man. If y'all need the hookups, just pull up right here. I'll get you right. Got everything you need, look. But yeah, mi raza, aquí tienen todo, mira, if y'all can see. It's all the bumpers from here guys we're finna go ahead and get the hd bumper pad the hd grill and the z71 tahoe valance with the fog lights because i'm at the guys he's a koopa 
And hopefully today we can slap everything on because, man, I'm already ready for a new change. To be honest, I'm done with the stock front end. As you can see, también, look, it looks all raggedy and all that. I don't like it, but yeah. Front yeah. end swap. Front end swap today, you know. Okay, pues mi raza, aquí ya tenemos el HD bumper pad y el Z71 balance. Ahorita nos van a traer los fog lights para que miren. Ahorita nos van a traer los fog lights so, for the Z71 balance and the uh, hd grill because that's what we're that's the last thing that they're, they're gonna go get right now but yeah guys these guys i'm telling you they have everything around here dfw if y'all if y'all need anything y'all let them know because these guys will hook y'all up damn these guys will hook y'all up and now i'm telling you man good prices too not too bad but uh yeah we already got the hd bumper pad and the c71 valence grill i mean grill uh valence with the fog lights and all they're needing to get right now is just the HD grill. But yeah, that should be it, guys. And if anyone knows or has any of these, any turning signal mirrors, those will be badass. What up, my raza? Yeah, we're gone. We leave in this place already, guys. If y'all want to come and check this, I'm gonna leave the, I'm gonna leave the Addy right here. I'm gonna put it somewhere around here. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and leave the Addy and all that, guys. So y'all come and pull up, show some love to these guys, man. They, they hooked it up for me. Not bad of a price too, because it came with a season one valence, the HD grill, and the HD bumper pad with the fog lights. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead, and go home, drive, and then uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get home and do all that other extra shit. I'm probably gonna stop by AutoZone to get the switch and all the extra wiring that I need, so I can put the fog lights on. Or if not, then I just won't put the fog lights yet. But guys, here's this concept here. Ahorita, compita Brian, ahí anda. Ahí que andamos todos. Well, guys, ahí está el Season 1 Valence, the HD Grill y el HD Bumper Pad. No cabieron allá atrás. Well, I would have taken it if I had some rope, pero nah, that shit was gonna fly out because it's windy out today. But yeah, guys, aquí andamos bien apachorrados. Parecemos pinches chucherías. But nah, ya nos vamos allá para Dallas, guys. I'll see y'all when I get home so I can explain everything that we're gonna do today. Hopefully, we get it done today. Yeah, primeramente Dios, guys. I love y'all. Appreciate y'all for waiting and sticking around for the video. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna put the address and the phone number down right here or somewhere around here in the screen so y'all can hit them up. Be like, hey, to his bro, I sent y'all. And then they'll give you a good, a good discount for that shit, too. Appreciate y'all, though. Okay, guys, so it's been a minute. I know, pinche heck, I need one. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna let y'all know AZ front end is done. It's all complete. We did all the welding, we did all the cutting, we did all the extra shit just to get the AZ front end in. But let me show y'all how it got done real quick. Flip the camera. But yeah, guys, look. HD pad. Got the Z71 Valence. HD grill. Everything got done, right, guys? Like, it was me and my dad. We was on it. Sorry I didn't, you know, record or anything. But I was just trying to get the trick ready because I needed it for Monday. And as you can see, guys, the fender right here is what's messing up this. So I need to get that fender fixed because if I don't, it's going to end up fucking on my HD pad. And then I'm going to see if I can buff out the chrome because it looks messed up right now because it's rainy and it looks... It don't look that bad, but... <clears throat> Once I get it, like once it's a good weather and all that, I will explain it to y'all more what and what I did. Or whenever I get the new headlights and the bow tie, and then I get the fog lights installed, I will do another video and see and like show y'all what and what was done to the truck. Because honestly, that day when I made the AZ front end, I did not record for nothing. All I recorded was me going to the shop and picking up the things. So hopefully guys, 
by like the end of this month hopefully if it's a good weather we can finally do it like it's, i can show y'all what and what we did i know i need a haircut because been almost like two months fam god damn but yeah guys this is a little update on the bubble eye i will be posting it today i think yeah which is april 9th i think should be up today but as well guys when i first got the truck i did the led lights and that was like the the main thing that y'all seen like from the truck from the bubble eye which was the headlights that was pretty much it that was the first upgrade i ever did to the truck you know a little upgrade i guess <clears throat> but now i'm gonna, I'm gonna tell y'all what and what has been done to it and what and what have i like dealt with with the truck since i've had it so i know as y'all see i had 18s on it before now i have these 20s ltz's because i i couldn't pass on the deals guys it was like bro i messed up the camera my bad my bad my bad but yeah guys like i was saying the last thing that y'all like seen on this truck was completely stock no hd no rims all these little details that i've been like thinking about and looking at they've been really bad and they were like bad 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 when i first got the truck so i'm gonna run through it what and what i did i got new ltz's i got new mirrors the other mirrors i liked them because they were like they had like the chrome housing on it they were pretty badass i liked it but one was so shaky and i was like if i'm gonna do that i'm gonna just do this other one and these are already primers so i can just like already go ahead and paint them color match them and i got the ltz's and i ended up doing like um how do i say i did like an led swap i guess you could say on like the inside like the led bulbs i don't know if y'all can see but hold on let me, give me a second oh yeah and i got new door panels guys yeah new door panels was the way to go the old ones were all crusty and they were really bad the rims i ended up getting for 500 door panels i got them for 110 new mirrors i got those for 10 bucks the pair and then i managed to get i managed to get all these like these little leds right here like all of these little leds are on like you know the top and all that on the bottom i got those for 30, 40 bucks i had some what's it called autozone discounts rewards and all that <clears throat> and yes guys the tires the i mean the rims did come with good tires they were pretty badass they're in good shape so i couldn't pass on that deal it was like one in the morning when i went to go pick them up and i managed also back then the tailgate did not have a tailgate handle and i managed to fix that not that long ago so that was also good you know something nice so it was pretty much tailgate handle rims hd front end led interior swap um tint i got tint done it's one percent in the like in the back and then 20 percent in the front of the driver and then i also got a brand new cluster i don't know if y'all can see that new door panels on this side as well i got a brand new cluster that's what it looks like that brand new cluster guys it does not it works like like everything works on it pretty much but the only thing i don't like about it is that it don't turn on even though i tried it on my brother's cat and it does turn on but the reason why it doesn't turn on is because i bought another cluster because my, my original oem cluster went out so i went to go buy a new one from a guy that lives in pleasant grove and i went all the way over there to go pick it up it was like 60 bucks so i went to go pick it up and my dumbass was like all right let's see if it fits and it was an 03 and 06 and if y'all don't know if you plug in 03 and 06 it's gonna fucking fuck up your shit pretty much so don't do it guys yeah yeah pa que always get the same year that your truck is or like the same area you know if you could like understand it a little bit and so yeah guys i ended up plugging in a 03 to 06 and it fried up the cluster lights and all that so I, I, that's like my fifth cluster already but that's like the custom one but once i fix all that wiring it should be good to go it's like a blue with like white escalade um hinges and all that shit it was badass though I'm, I'm, i'll probably show y'all a picture but yeah guys that's a little rundown on what i've done to the bub boy guys the cat eye really doesn't gotten much done it's just more just sitting but we're waiting on doing big things because that one's already dropped it's front end um system already it's already nice and built all we're, we're waiting is on the titan window two sunroofs and paint job and ss cladding so y'all guys i like i'll whenever we do that i'll go ahead and record do what i gotta do and i'll show y'all guys how it's done or everything or we might just take it to the shop let them record how it's done but yeah guys this is pretty much what i've done to the bubble boy guys 
I know it's not a lot, but for me it is because it took me so much time to like get it done because like the time that I bought it and all that type of stuff. But hopefully guys, by the end of, well I graduate next month, hopefully by the end of graduation it's dropped and it has its hood already done, it's HD cowhood. Drops HD cowhood and hopefully I could color match bumper, bumper pad, the valance, grill, and the mirrors and door handles. Hopefully I could, you know, do all that type of stuff. But yeah, guys, that's a little rundown on the bubble eye. Um, next time I get those other parts, I will go ahead and record for y'all, see what I would and what I did to the bumper to like make it fit and all the fitments and all that. But yeah, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. I know it wasn't that much of a big of a video. But I promise y'all, this is just a little update so y'all can be like, oh shit, okay, like, you know, the channel's still alive type shit. But yeah, guys, this is just a little bit of it. Just wait till I'm out of high school, fam. Just wait until I'm out of high school and I'm going to fix this truck up how I want it. And hopefully, yeah, guys, I graduate next month. And y'all can just be with me to the pro through the process of actually getting this truck done. And hopefully, I'll be able to take it to the show. I want to take it to Summer Truck Invasion in August. So yeah, guys, hopefully I'll be able to do that. But thank y'all for watching. This is Steven from Toys Garage, and I'm out.